Good morning. <laughs> Look how sweet Teddy's being to eat me. I am changing back over to the camera. I just really wanted to get <laughs> that shot because, oh my gosh, it is so sweet. Teddy is so, so, so intrigued by Eve. He always has been, and he's just really learning to be sweet with her, and I, I think she likes him back. Um, but today's a little different for us at home. Peter is actually in the office. Um, he's been going like once a week. This might be the fourth week he's done it. Maybe the third. Um, basically just, you know, the perks that go along with going into the office every so often. Um, we're prioritizing that. So dad is not at home today during the day. Um, and I always try to make these days a little bit more special for our gusto, especially on a Monday. Um, so yeah, well, I'll, I'll try to film as much as I can today. I do know that, so basically like another bit of this new, like we took this break from vlogging, we kind of like were resituating our schedule and, and just sort of like really figuring out what our minds and our bodies and our souls needed. And what's been working out really great for us is going out every other day. And so we were out yesterday and with, especially with Peter being gone, getting home from work a little bit later, we can't like zip out the door. So it always works out when Peter's in the office that that's the night we stay home. And also like either the Monday or the Tuesday, however it works out, um, that's when I typically edit our home archive so it'll probably be just like a cozier night I'll be away for a little bit editing um, but still I think with like it being the beginning of October I think I'm gonna put the kids in their Halloween uh, pajamas we didn't get to last night when we left the fort um, I think we're gonna have like a spooky cozy night what did I make for you pumpkin pumpkin yes, yes we're in our skeleton jammies Got some more cutouts. A witch's hat. A ghost. And a bat. So, wait, I feel like this was my first, like, true, specific pregnancy craving where I wanted crinkle fries specifically with ranch. I always like fries all the time. A lot during pregnancy, but I feel like Peter just usually just gets them for me because he's kind soul when I'm pregnant. Um, but this is very specific. Woo! He brought it home. Some people had been asking um, how the pregnancy is going. It's good, uneventful. I am 11 weeks, three days. Um, I actually did get in a little thunder bender. Um, and I went to the ER and I got to see the baby again because we were just being extra cautious. But everything was good. It was nice to see them again. I wasn't injured or anything. It just my doctor wanted to be extra cautious. Um, yeah, pregnancy has been good. I haven't gone to my normal OB yet, but that will be soon. I went to the office today. It was, it was the office. <laughs> we got an Aldi pickup order, but we're not going to do a haul. Because it's kind of a little all over the place, but yeah. we needed food. We just want to put it away because I want to get in comfies and not move. Teddy's being a true Midwesterner. <laughs> Dip, dip, dip in the ranch and eat in the ranch off the fry. Finished closing down downstairs, making sure Evie was good and everything. Cleaning some dishes, got just the place ready for the morning, feeling fresh. I got Sarah and I this big old glass of ice water. I also brought down a little bourbon apple cider for myself and just a straight apple cider for Sarah, as well as pumpkin loaf slices. Here, look. Not sure if we expressed this a couple of weeks or months or whenever it happened, but Sarah accidentally um, got in a fight with a laptop. I did the same thing I did two years ago. Yep. So we have it hooked up to the. Never balance your laptop on the couch. <laughs> had that hooked up to the TV, mm -hmm. and then brought some pump pumpkin loaf. Yep. While we, uh, I'm gonna look and see how the job market's looking as a potential, you know, solution to our growing family. And, and tonight's the night I'm going to do our archive. So this is the, when we say the archive, this is all the footage that um, is just for our memories that we don't, don't include in the public facing YouTube videos. Yep. Yeah. And this will get less extensive on these nights now that we're like back to posting daily. We've posted one daily thing, but we're right, back. Well, yeah, we're back. 
and for any of my friends at work, if you're seeing this, everybody knows. You all know. We've talked about this all the way from the team that reports to me, to my leader, to my leader's leader, that um, we're pursuing various options in the Burkhardt house to grow our career and our fan financial securities. We're talking, trying to secure some career advances at my current company, which is like top goal. Second goal is like looking for opportunities of growth outside of my company. Um, I had a leader once tell me, wink, wink, you know who you are if you're watching, because he, he might actually see this, that if you don't look at opportunities outside of your current company, you are writing off 99% of your chances to grow. So um, I'm not trying to leave my company per se. I'm just trying to pursue all my options before our next baby is here. So that's that little commentary there. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.